up YouTube? Today I'm gonna show you guys how to create that letterbox effect inside of Premiere Pro. Boosted. Boosted. As you can see from that video, I created a basic letterbox effect. Um, basically, what that is is these black bars on the top and bottom of my video. Um, it's real easy and simple to create, but this is with the letterbox effect. And this is without the letterbox effect. And basically with the letterbox effect, it just make your footage look a little more cinematic. I don't always use this effect, but I just use it sometimes. Just depends on the move and feel that I'm trying to go for for my video. But I'm gonna show you how to make this from scratch. It's real easy and simple. So let's get started. All right, the first thing you wanna do is you wanna go down here to new item so click on new item you want to look for adjustment layer so go ahead and click adjustment layer and click ok so what you want to do next is you want to drag that adjustment layer in your timeline above your clip and you drag that to the end of your clip and what you want to do next is you want to go over here to your effects tab in the search box you want to type crop so click on crop and drag that to the adjustment layer all right, so what you want to do next is you want to go up here to your effects control tab and you want to look for that uh, crop tab right here. So you want to change the top and the bottom. So for the top, I always do 12%. And as you can see, we just created our top uh, letterbox effect right here. And then you want to go to the bottom and type 12 to create our bottom uh, letter effect or well, our bottom letterbox effect. And that's basically it. Like I said, it's real easy and simple to create. So this is with the letterbox effect. And this is without the letterbox effect. Also to add another thing. Um, if in your video, if you don't if you don't have any headroom or like the person's head is cut off, um, you just go ahead and change it. I already did it, but I'm gonna show you how to do it from scratch. It's real easy. So basically what you want to do is click on the video and I'm gonna reset mine real quick. So basically click on the video, not the adjustment layer, but click on the video, go up here to your effects tab, go to motion and go to position and you want to change the Y value. So I'm going to drag the Y value to the right. As you can see, it's just bringing the video down because his head was cut off. So I'm going to go about right there. I like the way that looked. So this is what it looked like before. And this is what it like after. I just basically just dragged it down so I wasn't cutting off his head too much. And that's basically it. Also, another thing I'm gonna show you how to do real quick is I'm gonna show you how to save this as a preset. This letterbox preset is real easy and simple. Go to your adjustment layer, look for the crop tab right here, click on it, and to save this as a preset, all you gotta do is right click, go to save preset and type in letterbox and hit OK. I already got mine saved, so I'm not gonna press OK, but that's all you gotta do. And then what you do next is come over to your presets and you'll see the letterbox effect. So I'm gonna show you how to add that on there real quick. So I'm gonna delete this adjustment layer real quick. And I'm gonna drag this adjustment layer back on top. And I'm gonna go to my effects tab and I'm gonna go to my uh, preset being right here. Go ahead and click on that. And we're gonna add the letterbox effect. So that's basically it. It's just a shortcut and save you time from having to type in crop and drag it on the adjustment layer. So you just save it as a preset and just drop it on there. And that's basically it for this tutorial. If this video helped you in any kind of way, please leave a comment, a like, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content like this. Thank you.